Welcome back, everybody, to that wrestling you all know and love. This is EWA Monday Madness, and I am your commentator of the night, as I am every single week, along with BMIW Wrestling. Please check that out. Young talent making a name for themselves on a show for them. But as, as i like to remind you, if you're not following EWA Madness Wrestling on Instagram, you should right now, as you missed... You miss all the all the promos, all the action, all the announcements, and so much more to what's going on in the back. As we just announced the other day, the King of Wrestling Tournament kicks off tonight. But we open up the show with women's action as we've not had in a good while as Ashley Hayes, your current EWA Women's Champion, Goes one on one with returning Jade Killies. Couldn't be away from the ring or Ashley Hayes. It wants to reclaim her throne as EWA Women's Champion. Straight into a lockup, right for the head. Back and oh, out of nowhere! Wheel kick to the face of Jade Killies. And into a German. Keep in mind, Ashley Hayes, when she came back to the wrestling picture. Decided to learn the, mar the martial arts in Japan and focus on a Japanese style wrestling and came back with a well, struggling outcome as now coming to EWA Wrestling and things just turned as they kick up with another splash. And wait a minute, lifting. Oh, Danielson special. Danielson, wait a minute. Trying to break free, trying to break free, but no, does not break free. Wait a minute, she's gonna snap the arm. She's gonna snap the arm. Oh, just turn it backwards and inside out. I'm not sure the elbow's supposed to bend that far. Killing's out for revenge. Does not want to stop a momentum. Here we go, wait a minute. Electric chair position, wait a minute. No, countered. Hurricanrana! And Hayes has had enough. Spinning brain buster. To stop the momentum of Achilles. And into the corner, ooh. Elbow to the face. And to the back of the neck. Right for the pin waste, little time. Doesn't even get her the one count. Fired up. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Rocket kick. Could end the match. But isn't enough as she just has to unload the fury of the fist over. Oh, close eye duct. And Hayes sets Jade Killies into the corner. I think she's setting it up. That big boot to the side of the face. Well, if you ever wanted a facelift, you know how to get it.
Setting it up, the spear, the vicious spear from Killers. It puts down Ashley Hayes. Could see a winner. One, two, and almost a three as Ashley Hayes kicks out at two and stays in the match and prevents Killers at the moment from earning a title spot. And wait a minute, speaking of spots. Figure four lock targeting the legs and the ankles. Breaking free with pure disrespect. We're kicking things off. And we're kicking things off correctly with women's action. Bringing you back to EWA Monday Madness. And it looks to me this, this match could go either way. And the trifecta DDT! Ooh, into a forearm. I'm not sure what just happened there, but I think they may have bumped heads on the way. As Killian's trying to get back in the right up clothesline. Another one. Gets up and falls into a calf kick. I think she's looking for that middle rope spear. And isn't enough as Hayes knew exactly what was coming towards her. Has to move out of the way. After the leg drop guillotine, I thought that could have been it. But just wasn't enough. Wait a minute. Wait, I think she's setting it up for that shining wizard to put away Achilles. And end of the match. Two, three, come on, kick out. Oh, just wasn't enough. With no ability to, ability to kick out. Proving right, Ashley Hayes is your EWA Women's Champion once again. As it was no fluke. A very upset, upsetting loss from Jade Kidd is going to have to get back in the mindset of a wrestling ring after being away for over a month. Now back in the business. Just may have to change her arsenal if she's going to take out Ashley Hayes. Although, as we've seen in the past, she's been taken out by many WWE superstars. Back in her run in the WWE. As you look on the end of the night, we got Tat, we got King of the Ring, excuse me, King of Wrestling Tournament coming up. Don't go away. And we welcome you back with our first entrant and King of Wrestling Tournament Combat Wombat.
His opponent tonight. Eric Lyons makes his way to the ring as he challenges Combat Wombat as the first matchup in the King of Wrestling Tournament. The man who snaps necks ends the match and calls it a day and goes home and watches Netflix. Snapping necks and chilling is what this man lives by. And that's what he's going to do in this matchup. Is snap a man's neck, get the W, and move on to round two of the tournament. And not even a lockup. As Eric Lyons takes down Combat Wombat like a literal joke. In combat, Wombat may have some fight inside him. What a hurricanrana. Doesn't send him to the outside, but takes the man down from the ropes. Sing shot. Oh! Went to punch the man mid-slingshot, but didn't make it just in time as he landed the slingshot X-Factor. Into the ropes and back. And momentum boosted drop kicks and another one. With the speed, momentum, and aggressive behavior of Eric Lyons, I'm not sure exactly what Combat Wombat's going to have to do to get offense in this matchup. Went to make the mat tap out. Did hold him long. Oh, it's a gurry. Oh, here we go. And there we go with the neck snap. Two. Only gets him a one. Only a one. The true resilient one combat one by and more drop kicks. This man just has all the energy in the world as he's just. Treating combat like a little rag doll. And 
End of the day. I don't think Combat Wamba has any ability of getting any offense this matchup. As he's been struggling. Wait a minute! I spoke a bit too soon! Lion just having a field day with this one. Oh, look at the oh, modified headlock suplex. It's a very in interesting move coming out of Eric Lyons, and here we go again. Mushroom stop to put him away. One, two, three. Only a two. Could have been enough, but just wasn't enough. And wait a minute. He's taking out the ref. Just used a chair to his advantage while the ref was down as he purposely knocked down the ref to do something so, well, cheating. Only a one again resilient combat wombat could shock the system, dare I say, and get the W tonight. But the way this is looking, it looks to be an Eric has this all figured out. And here we go. Possible offense from Wombat. And oh, what a DDT. Takes down. And wait a minute. Over the ropes. Finally gets back in this matchup. DDT on the outside. Tornado style. And here we go again. Another slingshot X Factor. Could be the end of the match. Two and only a one. And no, this is just the beginning of the King of Wrestling Tournament tonight as we have another match later on this evening. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Setting him up could be the end of the match. Could be the end of the match as he snapped his neck to... Putting up Eric Lyons in round two. As we move on into the night, we got tag team matching with Rising Fortune, and they've been making a big, dare I say, rise in the tag team division as of late. As they have fixed their issues, gotten back in the ring. 
And they're really pushing that tag team name, Rising Fortune, as they take on tonight your current EWA Tag Team Champions, the Fury Fighters. As we welcome to the ring your current EWA Tag Team Champions, the Fury Fighters. There's only one way this is going to end. The rising, rising fortune shocks the world. And regains their spot for the EWA Tag Team Championship belt. Or the Fury Fighters just completely demolish rising fortune. Let's ring that bell and get this match going as... Oh! What a sportsman-like lockup. But Ethan Miller was not having it. And into the knee. Ref gets taken down. Anything can happen here. As Brian Kendrick is in control. Into the ropes. Under. And oh, Dr. Teeth. Takes down Miller, going for the pin, and not even a one count. <clears throat> Zach Saban gets tagged in. Jesus Christ, momentum, this European uppercut. Wait a minute, wait a minute. He uses this a lot in his arsenal, that arm and leg trap submission. I'm not sure exactly what you'd call that, but it seems to be very effective. Now back in them. Oh, what a kick to the face. High flying action. Oh. In the corner again! And do an uppercut. And another one! Kind of reminds me of the primetime days of Cesaro. And another submission hold to wear down Brian Kendrick as he has to make a tag to his fresh partner, Paul London, if he wants to change the momentum of this matchup. And as I speak, at the right moment, double super kick to take down Zack Saban. Turning the tides. Doesn't even give him a one. No respect given. Oh. 
Anyone at Anchor Lock, you don't normally see from Zach Saban. Might make him tap, but no! End of the corner. Oh, roundhouse kick! Zach Saban and Ethan Miller's chemistry just know all the stops. But maybe not this one! Maybe not this one! Went for a chicken wing face bust! Gut buster! But countered for the two! Could have been a shock in the system! And it was super kick to put Zach Saban back down! And again, doesn't give him the one count. And here's that gut wrench. Looking to tag in his partner, and it looks like they might be tend to tag in the exact same time. Brian and oh, same idea. And the Fury Fighters are back on top of the game and back in control. And now targeting the arm with the top rope arm breaker. Into a back to I think he was looking for that sliced bread. Two only gets him a one. Saban gets taken out. Brian Kendrick fired up! The game is changing! It went for a standing slice spread, but no! Wasn't enough! Just unloading with the boot to the gut! We've seen this before, and it injured a superstar like Pac-Man Davis. Is it going to injure another superstar? This could be it. Where is Paul London? Two, three. And Paul London just not able to save the count as the Fury Fighters walk away with the W tonight. I thought for sure Rising Fortune was going to fix their problems tonight. Shock the system. And walk away with a W against their Fury Fighters, but it just wasn't enough. As that drop kick into the corner seems to be an effective maneuver for these two. As we move on into the night for our main event. King of Wrestling Tournament Action up ahead. And welcome to our main event of the night. And the first round of the King of Wrestling Tournament. As we bring you back with Devin Young. Now, Devin Young is a, is a very most athletic, very, very tough person to defeat in a wrestling ring. As he may not be a new superstar, but he definitely wanted his hands on the tournament. 
and to be your king of wrestling, well, person of the year. As we see a challenger in Cam Stone making a, well, very special appearance in EWA. And if he's going to make an appearance and make his name known to Persona, he's going to do it right in EWA in this tournament as he looks to move to round two in the tournament. And here we go, the main event of the night. Devin Young and Camp Stone lock up for the first time. What a way to kick things off. Uh, another lockup. Here we go. A disrespectful slap to Devin Young. What an action to finish off the night. Went for a corkscrew, forearm smash, but countered it. As Devin Young isn't exactly a veteran in the ring, but he knows exactly how to maneuver in situations like that. And the ref is down, as Cam Stone could have won the whole damn thing for the main event of the night. And moved himself up to round two, but wait a minute, here we go, into the corner. And the chop and take him down. And wait a minute, here's the knee. Oh, rolling out of the way. I'm not sure if Cam Stone wants to be on this roster or if he just wants to win his whole damn tournament. Well, speaking of, speaking of, here we go to the outside, high flying camp zone. Sends himself to the outside, brings him back in the ring. Does not want the momentum to slow down just yet. As both these two have energy up the wazoo. Two, only a one count. And still Cam Stone looking a bit desperate. To get the W. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Underhook suplex. Didn't waste any time to go for the pin, but just wasn't enough as he snaps the neck immediately. <laughs> and 
setting it up. The big match finish. Big match finish for Capstone. And moving out of the way. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Death Valley Driver to put away Stone. And only gets the two. Now fire it up. And the corner of that spot. And another splash. Snapmare. Ends up Curry in the face. He's going up looking for a frog splash. To put away Stone. One, two, and three, no! 2.9 seconds. The match just has no end. But if there were ever a better main event, I don't know what it is, because right now, this is so far the best one of the whole damn year. And over the ropes... Devin Young just launching himself to take down Camp Stone. And from the top, setting him up. Clothesline, but countered by Stone, getting himself back in the matchup. And to the side of the got a drop kick. Bring this match into the corner. Maybe going up top. No. Never mind going up top. In to a red arrow. One, two, and almost a three. Could have been the end of the match, but didn't want to give up just yet. Oh, went for a hurt, Karate, but denied it. Now he's fired up. Camp Stone setting himself up for the W tonight. Wait a minute. Here we go. The fish is neck breaker. But is it going to be enough? Are you going to try it one more time? Oh, he hit it this time. He hit it this time. Could be the end of the matchup. One, two, and no. These two just do not know the term give up. This is the tournament. This is wrestling. And this is Monday Madness. Here we go. Oh! Just launching himself at Devin Young like a freaking torpedo. And there we go, that knee face buster to end it. Two and only a one. How are these two going to find a way to keep the other man down long enough to get the three or even make his opponent tap? And there's the answer, Curry.
Another frog splash. Wait a minute. Oh! Stop some momentum. And into an arm drag. Tossing the man across the ring. Into a headlock. Freaking seen her. Ooh, a modified back elbow into the corner. Impressive. Effective. It looks to be. Because in wrestling, your move, your move doesn't have to be, doesn't have to look good, just has to be enough to get the count of three. Into that single leg Boston Crab fighting out of it. We'll be going outside one more time. And oh, into a corkscrew. And from the road went for another clothesline. And Cam Stone again. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That knee boot to the face. No. Moves out of reach in time. Fell right in the trap of Devin Young. For a Death Valley driver. If he has any energy left. He'd be smart. And just go for the pin. But no. We're going up to the top rope. Into a frog splash. And we're going to call it a day. And this could be the end of the main event. One. Two. Three.